This page refers to the chemical compound. For the slow call band, see acetone. Acetone is the organic compound with the formula 2CO. It is a colorless, volatile, flammable liquid, and is the simplest ketone. Acetone is miscible with water and serves as an important solvent in its own right, typically for cleaning purposes in the laboratory. About 6.7 million tons were produced worldwide in 2010, mainly for use as a solvent in production of methyl methacrylate and bisphenol A. It is a common building block in organic chemistry. Familiar household uses of acetone are as the active ingredient in nail polish remover and as paint thinner. Acetone is produced and disposed of in the human body through normal metabolic processes. It is normally present in blood and urine. People with diabetes produce it in larger amounts. Reproductive toxicity tests show that it has low potential to cause reproductive problems. Pregnant women, nursing mothers and children have higher levels of acetone. Ketogenic diets that increase acetone in the body are used to reduce epileptic attacks in infants and children who suffer from recalcitrant refractory epilepsy. Metabolism Biosynthesis Small amounts of acetone are produced in the body by the decarboxylation of ketone bodies. Certain dietary patterns, including prolonged fasting and high fat low carbohydrate dieting, can produce ketosis, in which acetone is formed in body tissue. Certain health conditions, such as alcoholism and diabetes, can produce ketosidosis, uncontrollable ketosis that leads to a sharp, and potentially fatal, increase in the acidity of the blood. Since it is a byproduct of fermentation, acetone is a byproduct of the distillery industry. Metabolic use Although some biochemistry textbooks and current research publications indicate that acetone cannot be metabolized, there is evidence to the contrary some dating back 30 years. Acetone can be produced from the oxidation of ingested isopropanol, or from the spontaneous enzymatic breakdown of acetocetate in ketotic individuals. It can then be metabolized either by CYP2E1 via methylpyoxal to delactate and pyruvate, and ultimately glucose energy, or by a different pathway via propylene glycol to pyruvate, lactate, acetate and propionaldehyde. Production in 2010, the worldwide production capacity for acetone was estimated at 6.7 million tons per year. With 1.56 million tons per year, the United States had the highest production capacity, followed by Taiwan and mainland China. The largest producer of acetone is INEOS Phenol, owning 17% of the world's capacity, with also significant capacity by Mitsui, Sunoco and Shell in 2010. INEOS Phenol also owns the world's largest production site in Beveren. Spot price of acetone in summer 2011 was 1100 a euro 1250 US dollars per ton in the United States. Current method, acetone is produced directly or indirectly from propylene. Approximately 83% of acetone is produced via the cumin process. As a result, acetone production is tied to phenol production. In the cumin process, benzene is alkylated with propylene to produce cumin, which is oxidized by air to produce phenol and acetone. Other processes involve the direct oxidation of propylene, or the hydration of propylene to give 2-propanol, which is oxidized to acetone. Older methods Previously, acetone was produced by the dry distillation of acetates, for example calcium acetate in ketonic decarboxylation. Car. CH3COO, 2 a car O, S, plus CO2, G, plus 2 CO. Before that, during World War I, acetone was produced using acetone butanol ethanol fermentation with Clostridium acetobutylicum bacteria, which was developed by Chaim Wiseman in order to help the British war effort in the preparation of cordite. This acetone butanol ethanol fermentation was eventually abandoned when newer methods with better yields were found. Uses, about a third of the world's acetone is used as a solvent, and a quarter is consumed as acetone cyanide in a precursor to methyl methacrylate. Solvent, acetone is a good solvent for many plastics and some synthetic fibers. It is used for thinning polyester resin, cleaning tools used with it, and dissolving two-part epoxies and superglue before they harden. 
it is used as one of the volatile components of some paints and varnishes. As a heavy-duty degreaser, it is useful in the preparation of metal prior to painting. It is also useful for high-reliability soldering applications to remove rust in flux after soldering is complete. This helps to prevent the rusty bolt effect. Acetone is used as a solvent by the pharmaceutical industry and as a denaturant in denatured alcohol. Acetone is also present as an excipient in some pharmaceutical drugs. Although it's self flammable, acetone is used extensively as a solvent for the safe transporting and storing of acetylene, which cannot be safely pressurized as a pure compound. Vessels containing a porous material are first filled with acetone followed by acetylene, which dissolves into the acetone. One liter of acetone can dissolve around 250 liters of acetylene. Chemical intermediate, acetone is used to synthesize methyl methacrylate. It begins with the initial conversion of acetone to acetone cyanhydrin, CH3, 2CO plus HCN or 2C, O, CN. In a subsequent step, the nitrile is hydrolyzed to the unsaturated amide, which is esterified, CH3, 2C, O, CN plus CH3OH or CH2 equals, CH3. CCO2 CH3 plus NH3. The third major use of acetone is synthesizing bisphenol A. Bisphenol A is a component of many polymers such as polycarbonates, polyurethanes, and epoxy resins. The synthesis involves the condensation of acetone with phenol, CH3, 2CO plus 2C6H5OH or 2C, C6H4OH, 2 plus H2O. Many millions of kilograms of acetone are consumed in the production of the solvents methyl isobutyl alcohol and methyl isobutyl ketone. These products arise via an initial odor condensation to give diacetone alcohol. 22 co 2 c o ch 2 c o ch 3 Laboratory In the laboratory, acetone is used as a polar, a protic solvent in a variety of organic reactions, such as SN2 reactions. The use of acetone solvent is critical for the Jones oxidation. It does not form an azeotrope with water. It is a common solvent for rinsing laboratory glassware because of its low cost and volatility. Despite its common use as a supposed drying agent, it is not effective except by bulk displacement and dilution. Acetone can be cooled with dry ice to a 78 degree Celsius without freezing. Acetone dry ice baths are commonly used to conduct reactions at low temperatures. Acetone is fluorescent under ultraviolet light, and its vapor may be used as a fluorescent tracer in fluid flow experiments. Medical and cosmetic uses Acetone is used in a variety of general medical and cosmetic applications and is also listed as a component in food additives and food packaging. Dermatologists use acetone with alcohol for acne treatments to peel dry skin. Acetone is commonly used in chemical peeling. Common agents used today for chemical peels are salicylic acid, glycolic acid, 30% salicylic acid in ethanol, and trichloroacetic acid. Prior to cheam exfoliation, the skin is cleaned and excess fat removed in a process called defatting. Acetone, septisol, or a combination of these agents is commonly used in this process. Domestic and other niche uses Acetone is often the primary component in cleaning agents such as nail polish remover. Acetone is a component of superglue remover and easily removes residues from glass and porcelain. Makeup artists use acetone to remove skin adhesive from the netting of wigs and moustaches by immersing the item in an acetone bath, then removing the softened glue residue with a stiff brush. This chemical is also used as an artistic agent. When rubbed on the back of a laser print or photocopy placed face down on another surface and burnished firmly, the toner of the image transfers to the destination surface. Acetone can also be used in combination with automatic transmission fluid to create an effective penetrating oil. Brake fluid is sometimes used in place of ATF. These mixtures can be useful in loosening rusted or stuck bolts. Safety, flammability, the most hazardous property of acetone is its extreme flammability. At temperatures greater than acetone's flash point of a 20 AA degree Celsius, air mixtures of between 2.5% and 12.8% acetone, by volume, 
may explode or cause a flash fire. Vapors can flow along surfaces to distant ignition sources and flash back. Static discharge may also ignite acetone vapors, though acetone has a very high ignition initiation energy point and therefore accidental ignition is rare. Even pouring or spraying acetone over red glowing coal will not ignite it, due to the high concentration of vapor and the cooling effect of evaporation of the liquid. It auto ignites at 465 AA degrees Celsius. Auto ignition temperature is also dependent upon the exposure time, thus at some tests it is quoted as 525 degrees Celsius. Also, industrial acetone is likely to contain a small amount of water which also inhibits ignition. Acetone peroxide. When oxidized, acetone forms acetone peroxide as a byproduct, which is a highly unstable, primary high explosive compound. It may be formed accidentally. For example when waste hydrogen peroxide is poured into waste solvent containing acetone. Due to its instability, it is rarely used, despite its easy chemical synthesis. Health information, acetone has been studied extensively and is generally recognized to have low acute and chronic toxicity if ingested and or inhaled. Inhalation of high concentrations in the air caused irritation of the throat in humans in as little as 5 minutes. Inhalation of concentrations of 1000 ppm caused irritation of the eyes and of the throat in less than one hour. However, the inhalation of 500 ppm of acetone in the air caused no symptoms of irritation in humans even after two hours of exposure. Acetone is not currently regarded as a carcinogen, a mutagenic chemical or a concern for chronic neurotoxicity effects. Acetone can be found as an ingredient in a variety of consumer products ranging from cosmetics to processed and unprocessed foods. Acetone has been rated as a grass substance when present in beverages, baked foods, desserts, and preserves at concentrations ranging from 5 to 8 mg per litre. Additionally, a joint US-European study found that acetone's health hazards are slight. Toxicology Acetone is believed to exhibit only slight toxicity in normal use, and there is no strong evidence of chronic health effects if basic precautions are followed. At very high vapor concentrations, acetone is irritating and, like many other solvents, may depress the central nervous system. It is also a severe irritant on contact with eyes, and a potential pulmonary aspiration risk. In one documented case, Ingestion of a substantial amount of acetone led to systemic toxicity, although the patient eventually fully recovered. Some sources estimate LD50 for human ingestion at 1.159 grams per kilogram. LD50 inhalation by mice is given as 44 grams per meter 3, over 4 hours. Acetone has been shown to have anticonvulsant effects in animal models of epilepsy, in the absence of toxicity when administered in millimolar concentrations. It has been hypothesized that the high-fat low-carbohydrate ketogenic diet used clinically to control drug-resistant epilepsy in children works by elevating acetone in the brain. EPA EPCR AD listing. EPA removed acetone from the list of toxic chemicals maintained under Section 313 of the Emergency Planning and Community Right to Know Act. In making that decision, EPA conducted an extensive review of the available toxicity data on acetone and found that acetone exhibits acute toxicity only at levels that greatly exceed releases and resultant exposures, and further that acetone exhibits low toxicity in chronic studies. Genotoxicity Acetone has been tested in more than two dozen in vitro and in vivo assays. These studies indicate that acetone is not genotoxic. Carcinogenicity EPA in 1995 concluded, there is currently no evidence to suggest a concern for carcinogenicity NTP scientists have recommended against chronic toxicity carcinogenicity testing of acetone because the pre-chronic studies only demonstrated a very mild toxic response at very high doses in rodents. Neurotoxicity and Developmental Neurotoxicity The neurotoxic potential of both acetone and isopropanol the metabolic precursor of acetone, have been extensively studied. These studies demonstrate that although exposure to high doses of acetone may cause transient central nervous system effects, acetone is not a neurotoxicant. 
a guideline developmental neurotoxicity study has been conducted with isopropanol, and no developmental neurotoxic effects were identified, even at the highest dose tested, environmental. When the EPA exempted acetone from regulation as a volatile organic compound in 1995, EPA stated that this exemption would contribute to the achievement of several important environmental goals and would support EPA's pollution prevention efforts. 60 Fed. Reg 31634. 60 Fed. Reg 31634. EPA noted that acetone could be used as a substitute for several compounds that are listed as hazardous air pollutants under Section 112 of the Clean Air Act. Environmental effects, although acetone occurs naturally in the environment in plants, trees, volcanic gases, forest fires, and as a product of the breakdown of body fat, the majority of the acetone released into the environment is of industrial origin. Acetone evaporates rapidly, even from water and soil. Once in the atmosphere, it has a 22-day half-life and is degraded by UV light via photolysis consumption by microorganisms contributes to the dissipation of acetone in soil, animals, or waterways. The LD50 of acetone for fish is 8.3 grams per liter of water over 96 hours, and its environmental half-life in water is about 1 to 10 days. Acetone may pose a significant risk of oxygen depletion in aquatic systems due to the microbial consumption. References External links International Chemical Safety Card 0087, NIOSH Pogger Guide to Chemical Hazards, Acetone Safety Data Sheet, Hazardous Substances Data Bank Entry at the National Library of Medicine, SIDS Initial Assessment Report for Acetone from the Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development, Calculation of vapor pressure, liquid density, dynamic liquid viscosity, surface tension of acetone.